Hello! Today I'm here with a new video and today it is time for first impression again and I'm doing a first impression with the Lethal collab together with Teresa is dead, so Lethal is dead. I... I don't know if I can say that I know Teresa, but I knew... I know who, who she is and she know who I am. And uh, I've been following Teresa for a long time. A long time. I think I started to follow her when she had under like thousand subscribers. I remember that like Paulina Beauty did talk about Teresa and I watched the video and it was one of the funniest videos that I have ever seen. So this is the collab between Lethal and Teresa and it looks like this. This is a nine pan palette and these are single shades that you can take out if you want to but they have the name on the palette. It usually isn't like that with Lethal. But yeah. These are like inspired by old horror movies. So I'm going to do a look with this today and I actually think I know what I want to do and I'm going to do something a little bit more red-ish. So I think I will use like these two shades, this one, and maybe this one in my inner corner. I'm not sure. And we will see. So I'm just going to start and if it... <laughs> oh, this was a strange video. I'm just going to prime my eyes and then we'll get started. Okay. So I will start with, I think, the finer girl, even though that is a little bit more pinkish than the Vengeful Spirit. But I will start with final girl in my crease, just because I want something in my crease. And <laughs> if you don't follow Teresa's dead, do it. I remember the first video I saw about her. She before in the beginning of all her videos she did a story time the first video I saw with her it was such a fun story time i needed to show it to my boyfriend and we both like stood in the kitchen and cry because we laughed so much and then <laughs> i was like hooked and i have been following teresa for a long long while And I think it was so fun when she announced that she was going to do a collab with Lethal. I love Lethal and I'm always so happy when people that I know do a collab with a brand. Maybe I don't know her but I hope you understand what I mean. Why do I make it hard for myself? I have no idea. So like I'm guessing that these shades are the same good quality lethal shades that they usually are. And this shade I have nothing to complain about. And she also came with some of their eyeliners or their gel liners. They were so cool the colors but like I never use gel liners and they were going to dry up for me before I even got like a chance to get somewhere in them but really cool colors and this is the second collab that Lethal do they have done with a German youtuber that is called Yolina 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 Jolene. <laughs> I had the palette here. Um, this was a palette that like the shades are not singles but in this it is and I think that is good. I love that about Lethal. Lethal. Okay, so I think I'm going to do a pretty simple look. I'm going to use Wench Vengeful Spirit on my outer corner of my lid and then I'm going to take Asian 
ancient struggles ancient evil this one like I know how the word is supposed to be pronounced but like I can't but it's okay because English is not my first language it's good to do like videos in the language not your first language you can always like if you can't pronounce a word I can always blame it on that that's good okay, these two really really good together and this was really a really nice shade okay I think if I would have wanted to I could just have slapped this shade all over my lid and then take something in my inner corners but I'm not going to do that. No. I'm not. So now I'm going in with this an 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 ancient... Ancient... Yeah, you, this shade. What I like about this palette is that the shade names is on the palette. They usually isn't on Lethal's palette. They have done some... bundles and released magnetic palettes to them but the shades isn't on because you can buy the magnetic palettes on its own so I think it's a good thing but also I understand why they usually don't have it but this one they do Nothing to complain about this shade either. So I'm, I'm happy with this look. I'm just going to do the same on this eye and this shimmer shade was kind of flaky. They have some metallic shades and then they have some shimmer shades that are a little bit more flaky. I have nothing against any of them. It's just now I have like flakes all over no not all over but like down here and I think if you do your base first maybe you should spray this or like having a glitter glue or a little bit more of a sticky base now we just have my eyeshadow base and for me it works because I'm going to take this away and then I'm going to do my base so I'm guessing if you've done your base you maybe don't want this. Me and my crazy eyes, <laughs> me and my crazy fallouts, I'm done like this. So I'm going to do my base and my brows and do my under eyes, but I'm going to save my inner corner highlight to do together with you because I think I'm going to do a matte shade. So I will fix this face and then I'll come back. Okay, for my inner corner, I I actually think I will take body snatch this one and take a stiff a little stippling brush not stippling a stiff a little pencil brush and put it in my inner corner so I will tap this off and then I will take it in here I really like this color and I'm not surprised because like these kinds of greens I think they are really good really fun and I even though I love like a really shimmery in the corner I also like to take a matte shade and I think this was a good color and I can like match depending my waterline with this one so I will put something in my wash line, put on mascara, try to choose a lippy, and then I come back with a complete finished look. So this is the finished look for my wash line. I used LA Girls Screaming. It's not green, I know, but it's like the most neon 
eye pen I have and for my lips I used one from Lethal. This is Wasteland. I don't know. Green lips. I love it on others. On me I think I look grey in my face so but I have it and I want to use it so I'm trying it to this look. I'm not sure but yeah <laughs> this is my finished look with the Lethal is Dead palette that is a collab between Lethal Cosmetics and Resisted. I think the Lethal shades is the normal formula the ones I've used. I'm going to do more looks with this. I just don't know what yet. Maybe two look, two looks with this. We will see. But so far, like it. I think it is the normal, lethal formula. And I really wish that lethal would come out with more collabs with YouTubers, because I think it's a fun that they do a collab that is a palette but I can take these shades and put it together with other if I want to and just take an empty magnetic palette so yeah I like the look I like the eyes I don't know about the lips I like the palette I love lethal shades so I was guessing that I was going to like this so yeah that's everything for this video and if you haven't checked out Teresa do it because she's so funny i i just love her she has like really her own way she's kind of unique i think so if you want to have fun go and check Teresa out i will of course leave her channel down in the description and she's been up here i think in the beginning of the video so don't forget to check out Teresa and I really hope you like this video. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please do so you don't miss any of my videos. And I will try to do two looks, one palette with this. It's just so many things I want to do right now and I don't know when I'm going to have time to do it. But yeah, I really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribed to my channel, please do. I have already said this, I think. But yeah, I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!